Good uh, morning, everybody. Uh, welcome to Flora Friday. Today, we're going to be talking a little bit about this plant over here called wild cotton, Gossypium herbaceus. The closest relative to this plant is actually a family that we know as the milkweed family. So the milkweed plant that a lot of you will know is actually closer related to the wild cotton than the actual cotton that we use for the commercial industry that people plant on their lands, etc., etc. So wild cotton has got a, 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 a few very interesting medicinal uses to it. Uh, one of them being that if you take the outer bark of the root, so you dig up the plant, you take the outer bark of the root, you boil it in water, and you give that to a lady that is in labor to drink, it actually um, it, it, it uh, elevates the levels of oxytocin in the, in, in the brain. Um, and uh, what oxytocin or the love hormone basically does, it helps with um, uh, ladies that are in labor with the, with the uh, contractions. And then uh, in some uh, very rural areas uh, up in Africa, they actually also use this plant as a contraceptive for men. So what they do is this, uh, this plant's got little seeds in it. And if you press these seeds all together, a little uh, oil comes out of it. Um, this oil is, has got a substance called gossypol. Okay. This gossy pole lowers the sperm count of men. So in, in rural areas, uh, they, will, they will take this oil to uh, basically uh, to use it as a contraceptive for men. So I'm going to show you how to use wild cotton for making a fire because that's one of the human uses of this, uh, of this plant. So it's extremely flammable. This is a magnesium stick or uh, also known as a flint. And, uh, and obviously you always need a, a bush knife with you. But if you use them together, you can make a fire extremely fast. There we go. No lighter or matches needed. So ladies and gents, that was it for today. If you like this video, please subscribe to the Eco Training channel. Uh, which you see below.